BAM! Today we're taking a look at the Tawand Waste Pack. Yet another fanny pack, which are always great. Um, so it's got a seal on here, but the seal is not sealed in the box closed. So I don't know if uh, our version's been tampered with at all. Open it up inside here. I would like to note that the color I got is blue. Um, the blue with the two water bottles. They do have versions that do not come with these. They're uh, some handy dandy water bottles that are designed just to fit in this fanny pack perfectly. And there's the blue fanny pack. So, ooh. All right, so very first impression. First off, it smells like it's a strong, it's not a bad smell, it's a very new pair of leather sneakers smell. That's what it smells like, and I like it. Um, this material here feels very nice. We've got these in here, which I assume they go around the top of the water bottle, and you can tighten them up to hold them in, because we got two water bottle slots on this bad boy. And here's the main attraction, the main compartment. Inside here, there is... I guess that's supposed to be a pocket. I'm not quite sure. It's... I don't know how well this is going to come out on camera or anything, but it's one big pocket with a strap going through. It's got another strap on it to make a little pocket hanging in the middle. Uh, I'm not quite sure. So right here is where I assume you'd put your headphone jack through when you got your phone inside and you're going for a walk or a run, but this is covered up by fabric, except for the tiniest little opening in the corner there, which you are not going to be able to get anything through. That might honestly just be a hole. I think that's just a hole in the fabric right there. That's not that's not intentional. Um, so I'm not quite sure why this is here. Um, me personally, I would I would just cut a hole in this right there. Uh, on the back here, isn't really any padding. This texture on the back there, which I guess is supposed to give you a little bit more grip. And this strap definitely feels cheap. I, I don't know if the strap is going to break. Let me see, can I... Alright, so it's not tearing right away, so that's good news. But... <laughs> this buckle is going to break. I'm going to tell you that straight up. Oh yeah. I have... I've been through many fanny packs, and the biggest thing, first thing I always look at, is the buckle. Because this buckle is a very cheap buckle. Um, if you're careful with it, it'll be fine, but I can't tell you how many of these little prongy things I've had snap off on buckles, so you're definitely going to watch that. Water bottles that come with it, they are, uh, they're definitely just cheap water bottles. Don't know if I'd use them. They have an interesting shape. They're kind of bent like that. Um, opening is large enough to get an ice cube through. So that's a big thing for me. That's already a plus. They're not very easy to open and close either, but these just slide right in here. And since they come with the fanny pack, they do fit it perfectly. I'm not sure. Am I supposed to put it in this way or this way? Here, let's take our strap and put it over the top so that our water bottles don't fall out. So these are some very small water bottles. They're 10 ounces each, so you're only going to be having 20 ounces of water on here. But inside there... We have here our standard five and a half inch phone. We're just gonna slip it in and that fits perfectly inside there. No struggle, but it's also not flopping around too much. So we're gonna look at these tightening straps, which again are pretty cheap, but I do think they should be able to get tight enough. Okay, there's one thing to note. This is the only strap that tightens this one. Nothing to tighten it with, all right? So let's try it on. Although I will say, tightening this fanny pack is much easier than a lot of other fanny packs once you have it on. Despite, I don't know how long it's going to last. But, with our fanny pack, taking a look around this buckle, I, I honestly I don't know how long it's going to last. There's a little strap here, but if you've got a very thin waist like me, this um, you're going to have a lot hanging down here. You can access your phone and everything in here while you're using it pretty well. You could also fit some light snacks, a wallet few things in there, not a whole lot. And you got your water, so when you're thirsty, you just pop it out, take a swig, and put it back in. Tighten it up so you don't lose them in case you're doing some intense rock climbing or anything of the sort. 
All right, so I'm gonna say, right now in the current state it's in, um, I think that this is a decent fanny pack. Definitely not the best that I've seen, but also definitely not the worst. It is fairly high quality on the fanny pack itself, but I am a little bit wary about these straps and buckle. I don't know how long those are gonna last. If you're in for the long haul, I don't know if this is the fanny pack for you, but if you just need a quick little fanny pack to carry some stuff around you're gonna use on occasion, then I see no reason why you shouldn't get this. It's got water bottles, hold your phone, wallet, everything. You're good.